So what are the advantages and disadvantages of fully associative mapping? Coming to advantages, uh, there is a flexi flexibility as to which block to replace when a new block is read into cache. Uh, this means whenever we need to replace a, mem a block from main memory into the cache memory, uh, we replace because whenever a cache miss occurs, we need to get the required block from the main memory and re replace it with uh, one of the block in the cache memory. So to do this, we have no particular restrictions uh, like only from this particular line of cache memory is to be replaced. We can replace any line. We uh, to the to do this, we have few algorithm like most recent used or least recent used algorithms. And coming to another advantage, there is no restriction on mapping from memory to cache. So when we initially place a block from main memory to cache, uh, it is not essential that we need to put it in only one particular line. We can place that block in any of the line in caching memory. So when coming to disadvantages, associative search tags is expensive. So we have a tag associated to each and every line in the cache memory so we do a search we need to search each and every tag so to get the required value so till we get a cache hit we need to keep searching and this searching takes a lot of computational power and it is feasible for a very small size caches only because uh, as we said discussed uh, the earlier point we need to keep searching till we get the required tag value so Till there is a match between the tag value of physical address and the tag value of the cache line memory, we need to keep searching, searching, searching. So because of this, uh, when there is a huge cache memory, we this comparison is becomes a huge task. Uh, this is discussed in the next point. The complex circuit circuit required for parallel tag comparison is however a major disadvantage. So whenever there is a huge cache memory, we have uh, many tag values so to get one tag value we need to compare it with many tag values and this is going to take much computation power and much cost to design that circuit the comparing circuit so this is the major drawback in fully associative mapping